this is the reality of our, our whole existence is believing God. When you come into a church where we don't just read off sermons somebody has sent us from some headquarters and we get down and pray and God gives us something, that's a different kind of thing. And this whole church operates that way. When we meet together, we ask the Holy Spirit to lead and to guide. This pastor doesn't have to get up and be a big entertainer. You know, don't have to tell a dozen jokes and uh, run and scream and get everybody shouting and run around the building. I don't want to. I'm not made that way anyway. I, now, I have shouted run myself oh, several times in my life. It gets so happy in the Lord. What I'm trying to say is there is the power of the Holy Spirit that is real in your everyday life when you let him be. And he's real in this service this morning for whatever need you have. If you are in, in need of healing, he's here. And that Joyce, Joyce caught that seed. And she they asked the, you to come down here. And this was exactly what the word says. Call for the elders of the church and they shall anoint them with oil and pray the prayer of faith. And they did that this morning. But if you have something in your life today, the devil has been tweaking and just twisting on you, trying to make you feel God doesn't love you for some reason. Tell him he's a liar. God does love you. And you're going to hold on to the Lord till the answer comes. And it'll be well worth it when it comes. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah.